proxy code exploit coming to you right now. Welcome back for another educational how-to video brought to you by your community DeFi team here at UrgDoc. Just remember, we're not financial advisors and this is not financial advice. You're solely responsible for your own actions anytime you engage in capital markets. Speculate at your own risk. In today's topic, we're going to cover the importance of proxies and exactly what you need to look out for and why they're important. Usually, contracts are immutable, meaning that they cannot be changed or be updated. And what you see is what you get. A proxy in the code breaks this rule. It refers to another address to get its final instructions on how to execute transactions. This means that the master chef can essentially change or be upgraded to anything the owner wants, including malicious code. Pointing the proxy to a new contract that contains malicious code would be a very easy way to steal all staked funds and hard rug. While proxies could be used to upgrade contracts to future features, we at RugDoc caution against any proxy since it opens up the contract to allow it to be anything including code that will steal your hard-earned pairs. It's much better to have the farm deploy a new contract and then allow users to withdraw and deposit in that new contract on their own. Now, this master chef that we're looking at here does in fact allow for proxies to come into play. That code right there allows a proxy to interact with this master chef and change its instructions. So that's what that looks like. This is the proxy contract right here associated. So essentially, when you have that original MasterChef contract, all someone would have to do would be introduce this new code through the proxy, and then it can change all the instructions that were originally set in that MasterChef when you might have looked at it originally. This is why we don't really like to mess around too much with any master chefs that allow for these proxies. And now you know. Here at RugDoc, we commit to the safety of our community first and foremost, so I hope your funds are safe and that this is now a part of your new farm risk mitigation strategy plan. Be sure to check out all our links below and hit that like button and be sure to subscribe for more excellent educational content. We'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.